The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. The one, the only, Logan Paul. Well, there are quick learners, and then there's Logan Paul. You can count his matches on one hand, but he's already a main eventer and in the championship picture. I, I have a question for you guys. How many folks can say they made their WWE debut across the ring from Rey Mysterio at WrestleMania? You're right, Corey. Uh, Logan Paul accomplished something that few ever have. And Rey Mysterio was the one who felt the honor. Oh. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. Introducing the challenger from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 185 pounds, Logan Paul. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 201 pounds, he is the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Price. Intensity on the face of the champion. Challenger in the corner, looking more determined than I've ever seen. in this match really couldn't be any higher. Uh, you can tell these superstars are ready to give their all to walk out of here the champion. They might be limping out of here if this match is even half as intense as I think it might be. Close line! Off with their head. A oh, foot just stomping down. Mistake made by Logan Paul. Firm control. And a big Oh, man. Turned that one around. Fends off the attack with an elbow. 
Seamless transition into the squared circle has been quite the surprise for him. Those athletics have definitely been a key factor in his success so far. Is his opponent going to be able to overcome that tonight? While Paul's certainly an impressive athlete and obviously extremely confident, he's still relatively untested in WWE. Honestly, part of me suspects that Paul's confidence is a house of cards. All you need is a gentle breeze to bring it tumbling down. Here is your winner, and still WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Price. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Ben The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 218 pounds, Kenny Omega. This is someone I can give my full support to, someone who has the guts to stand up for what's right. What are they, a knight in shining armor? Give me a break. A competitor who does not know the meaning of the word quit. He is ready for battle. competing at such a high level. I predict one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. A guy who treats every match as if it's the biggest one of his career. He definitely plans to steal the show tonight. Now, this is a superstar coming into this one with a major chip on his shoulder. Feels like he's not gotten the respect from the division that he's deserved lately. Yeah, but respect has to be earned in matches like this, not just handed out. If he can prove himself here, maybe he will get the respect he believes he deserves. Gonna have to dig down deep here tonight. Yeah, but he's taking on a superstar with a mean streak a mile wide. I know I wouldn't want to be in the ring with this guy. Drop kick. Great ups. How's that for a counter? Max Randle from the middle rope. Right. 
Left by the turnbuckles. Who hits him with the counter? A striking blow. Rolling elbow finds its 
mark. Ouch. And now he's on the down. Hoisted up. Son of a We might just be seconds away from the end. There's two. Finally ends it. And all the bloodshed. Perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner, Kyle. And with the results of this battle plain to see on their face, at least they can say they won the match. This was a grueling match both physically and... Here comes a tremendous third-generation luchador. High-flying skill and unparalleled arrogance on display. The following is a steel cage match. Making his way to the ring from Monterey, Mexico, weighing in at 205 pounds, Angel. One half of the lethal lovers, Los Lotharios. And now women are interested in his cousin Umberto, too. What a great wingman. Best believe this angel is going to fly. That was really good, Saxton. Deep thoughts there. A promising high-flying talent. That man who has finally found that aggression it takes to break through. And his opponent from Monterey, Mexico. Weighing in at 198 pounds, Umberto! An athlete who is both captivating and handsome. A true smooth operator between the ropes with lethal ability. He says it's all about dominance tonight and plans on showing why everyone backstage should be scared. The exit door is shut and secure. The steel cage match can now officially get going. And look at the pure determination on the faces of these competitors. They know the stakes. They know the dangers of the situation. And they are ready to go to war. Drop kick! Great athleticism. Impact in the corner. They're slamming their face down. Nothing worse than that feeling the first time flesh meets steel. The pain and shock to go coursing through your body when it happens. Not exactly the type of thing any superstar wants to go through. But in this match, you have to learn how to bear. Learn how to withstand the onslaught of pain. Endurance is truly key. Oh, my gosh! Can he do it here? A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. And those kick outs are only going to get harder. Scoreboard pinning combination. Oh, maybe not. Crashing down like that, having the weight knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. He's getting a little batter now. What a beautiful moonsault. And that is not supposed to look that easy, ladies and gentlemen. He's been placed in the corner now. Chris Lock and they'll turn it into a Well 
scouted by Umberto. Oh my goodness, launched into the cage. Tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Uh oh. We're going to see it. What power. <laughs> Sit down. Power bomb. A power bomb's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. What a counter. There have been some amazing rivalries throughout history, but this one may be the most heated we've ever seen. Yeah, Byron, they may have taken this to a level many have never seen before. I know what this superstar is going for. A, a muscle buster? No! Goodness! Umberto locks the arms, rings of Saturn submission, cinched in! Oh, just tap out, just tap out and end this thing. Trapped and nowhere to go, trying to muscle out of this. Look at the hook, the determination! facility tomorrow to quote a pair of awesome scholars in life the following contest is a tables ladders and chairs match and it's for the wwe united states Here comes Finn Balor. A man who has truly embraced his darkness and has seen success as a result. Introducing the challenger, representing the Judgment Day. From Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn. The Prince has arrived and is more lethal than ever. Hey, a sense of pure animosity to him. Well, it's just the fact that Finn Balor's finally been able to free himself of any limitations WWE or the WWE fans have placed upon him. Yeah, well, I guess freeing himself of said limitations also translates into turning his back on the entire WWE Universe. Boo-hoo, Byron. The results speak for themselves. Look 
Look at the focus in Balor's eyes. Yeah, Balor looks ready to clear the obstacle that awaits him. Byron, I think Finn wants to do more than clear the obstacle. Finn looks ready to obliterate the obstacle. Here comes a reckoning. The archer of infamy, ready to pass judgment. And introducing the champion, representing the Judgment Day from New York, New York. Weighing in at 249 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, Damian. No longer cares for the WWE Universe. No longer cares for the rest of the locker room. Because he has found his true family. And the Judgment Day is their name. You will not win a psychological battle with Finn Balor. This superstar has got to bring the fight to the Prince tonight. that a United States Championship match has. It's hard to nail down exactly what it is. I know what you mean, Byron. Whether defending or challenging for the U.S. title, superstars seem to go the extra mile. Right in the face. My God. Great wherewithal on the counter. Ooh, take it up the knee. Oh, the reversal by Priest. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Superstar, even the odds. Simply, Cole, they can't hesitate, not even for a moment. If a superstar takes their eyes off the end goal in a TLC match, they could lose all momentum they had going for it. Climb, go for it, climb. Oh, man. That's just hard to watch. Oh, 
shoulder. That'll divorce it. Priest gets countered. Finn Balor. Oh, 1916. Balor has him in the drop zone. This is where Finn Balor's at home. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm has shifted. Interesting move here, Byron, as he starts to set it up. I wonder what he's got in mind here, Michael. You gotta wonder what he's thinking here, guys. I don't know what he is thinking. This is how people get seriously hurt. Let's right? go. You gotta be kidding me. Throwing caution to the wind, and both superstars pay the price. Getting a ladder in position now. Smack down to the center of the ring, too, Cole. Scaling the ladder now. Cutting and hook it. It's a big in this one. Priest tied that one. No way! Somersault plancha to the floor. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Boom! Double leg takedown. out of the ring. What's next? And now getting the ladder in place on the ring apron. And don't sleep on how dangerous a spot that is for a ladder. He's setting up the ladder now. Looks like to me he's got it in the right spot, Michael. Oh, right oh, into the ladder. I don't know how stable that looks, Michael. Black and finish that ladder is positioned perfectly. Hey, you gotta be careful. So many things can go wrong up there. And he's taking this to the outside now. Ah, right to the throat. Great move. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs. No worries. He's got the table. And I can only imagine what he's thinking of doing with it. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. He steers clear of contact. is so chaotic. They've taken so it to dangerous. a new level here tonight. Well, I don't think either one of these superstars would be the same after this match. Working his way up the ladder now. This is a critical moment. What? What? Don't get all the... No, 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 no! Oh, and high! Putting everything on the line, risking it all to come falling out of the sky. Sends the knee into the face. That'll stop you. Climbs back inside. Priest with the elevated flatline. And Priest is still able to resume as a 
moonsault. Balor is getting dragged into a very dangerous position here. Looks like he has something planned with his table, guys. I don't want to know. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. He's planning something big to finish his opponent. This is too much. Someone's going to get hurt. Taking this one back to the ring now. And that's perfect positioning for the ladder. Money. He's doing some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. Hey, don't look now, but that ladder is lined up perfectly. Showtime! Oh, this is so dangerous. So dangerous. Oh, what is going to happen here on top of that? Using that well-placed table to great effect. Looks to me like that ladder's positioned perfectly in the center of the ring. Now you just gotta climb. Try to sneak a victory here. Going for it. Interesting timing to say the least. The taker retains. Here is your winner.